One school district struggled to stop repeated fights in its hallways. Well, now we can report things are actually getting better. New at 10 tonight, Sayed Shabir is live at Smith Hale Middle School to explain what's behind this improvement. Sayed? Well, Mark and Krista, over the last three years, Smith Hale has had nearly 1,000 fights. That's more than the number of days the school has even been open. But new grant money and new leadership is helping change that trend. As students celebrate the end of the school year at Smith Hill College Preparatory Academy, the teachers and staff are celebrating something much more important. For years, the school of nearly 1,000 sixth and seventh graders has struggled with fights. In 2010, there were more than 430 reported fights in the less than 200 days of school. But in just three years, that number has dropped by half. Progress, the district says, is a result of recently hired principal Jermaine Wilson. The one thing that we've worked with students on uh, is being able to process, being able to resolve conflict uh, without having physical altercations. To Wilson is completing his second year and says the drop in fights is a direct result of additional funding from a Missouri School Improvement Grant which was used to add staff members hired specifically to help prevent fights. We have a parent involvement coordinator, a behavior interventionist, and additional staff members and tutors uh, who are here to provide wraparound supports. The grant money won't return next year, but the district says the improvements have been so substantial that it will include the funding in next year's budget to retain all the positions. While some parents think the progress is promising, Benny Jackson, who has a seventh grader at the school, isn't impressed. Fights may be down, but if our grades and our students still aren't achieving, then I, I don't think it matters. That's now, the other factor that has reduced the number of fights is parent involvement. When Principal Wilson came to the school two years ago, the PTA was inactive. Now, not only is it active, it's been recognized by the state for having the highest increase in parents. Membership is up 1,200%. We're live tonight. Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.